Hello, Mrs. and Mrs. Time for inscription. Uh, this game is epic. Okay, yeah. So I was in the next frame, which contains a cabin. Can I, can I get out? Yeah, I can get up. This is done. This... I haven't found this out yet because I need the beehive. I, I think I need the beehive. So, what else is around here? Okay. They are empty. Okay. Hmm. Now there are two teeth. Thank you. Uh, two teeth? Yeah, I don't get it. I don't remember actually anymore. Uh, so. But. In the frame, oops, in the game frame, the door is open. Okay. Let's keep going. So, uh, artifacts, I don't think I need them. This, I don't remember what it was, and it is to sacrifice a creature into another one, which is always good. Almost always good. Because you can make cards stronger. Ooh. This card should actually receive power, but I need to get rid of the black card because it by itself is not that good. Or I can give triple triple created strike to someone. No, you're not going. I mean, you could, but the avement is got in both sides. Why do you always ask to go, actually? I don't know. So Black Goat is a good sacrifice. For the cat. Which means I can play any card to the cat if I possess it. However, I should have two cats instead of just one zero two. Uh, yeah, let's place the goat here. You wanna get sacrificed? Because I'll sacrifice you if you do that, you know? Uh, so... Hit. Okay, uh, wish me luck. Your eyes fix themselves on the small cabin. Yes, of course. It's a warm light beacon of the oppressive darkness of the night. Surely, surely this cabin mar marked the end of your... Travels. Oh boy. Hello? Oh, 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 okay, I'm literally outside. But if I go inside, I'll get trapped in the game again. What? What? I cannot see it. Uh, is there a lantern or something? Oh boy. Steps away from the strange cabin. You were presented with an opportunity. I don't offer my boons to just any traveler. If you are able to pass my trials, you will be rewarded mightily. Mightily? Okay. A ring! The worm ring! The three drawn cards must include a card with a sprinter sigil! Bro, I don't have any of these. Can I check my deck? I think the only one is this. And I think I only have one card with this symbol. Literally one. It's high noon. 
luck of the draw. Let the trial of the swift begin. Oh boy, oh boy. Oh, I got it! Success! My most powerful boons? A card that's a dramatic alter of the game and you don't even need to draw them. What? The boon of the forest. You will start a battle with Grand Fires. Fires? Fears? On all your spaces. I have no idea what this is. The boon of the goat's blood. You will start a battle with a black goat on the board. That's pretty good. Boon of the magpie's eye. When you draw from your deck, you may choose... Holy shit, it is broken. Two of them! Are you kidding me? Oh, wait. I, I didn't read what it was. Oh, and I cannot press it because I will select that one. Okay. The trial of the find. The tree drawn card must include a card with waterborne sigil. I have like two cards with that. The trial of the rarity. The tree. Oh, rare cards. How many rare cards do I have? Is Mantis God a rare card? I think it is. Mantis God. I got draw I drew two. Yeah, Mantis God. Oh, the rare cards have this uh, edgy thingy. It is different. Okay. You choose your boons. Please read them. The boon of the ambidextrous. Oh boy. I read this thing, it is just broken because it stacks with the other boon that I just got. Yeah, whatever. And you also have to Yeah, I'm with extras. Thank you very much. So, unless the game just. the difficulty just spikes or something. Oh, wait, this is. Boost, boost my buttons. I barely say this, but I'm impressed. You must have been a worthy adversary, but unfortunately must soon put you to death. Okay. Now I'm broken. I mean, I should be broken. Wait, I was teleported back? Hello? Oi? Oh! You took your time out there. And I'm itching for another game. You are ready to play? Not really. So, you are a mycologist or something? Oh boy. Oh yeah, I, uh, I should have actually... Are you kidding me? I have one candle. Zero six. Oh, Mantis God is broken. Okay. Uh, I need retaliation damage. I don't have retaliation damage. I will take two or three damage from it, depending. So, if I place it here. Wait a moment. I can cheat the first phase. One thing that's bothering me is that these uh, things keep spinning. So, I think he will do one of its abilities. Whenever one of the candles goes away. So one. Two. Three. It's the same mask again. So there are three end abilities. One was, was the fisherman's hook. The other is the gold thingy that kills all my creatures. What was the other one? I do not remember actually. And probably the music is quite loud, give me a moment. Alright, still loud? Still loud. Uh, now can you hear me? Yeah, probably good. So...
Greater smoke will not retaliate. It will deal only one. However, if I move a card here... Death touch. I should save this, save this for less, actually. Whenever I draw a card, I can draw two. I need to draw the cat. Hmm, so I can delay his card if I just play a card in here, because it will block it. Need to place this in front of the Mantis God. So you require two bones, that's my issue. If I place Mantis God right now, I will get destroyed. And I only have one life. What is this? I have. Oh. Thanks for using your head. And I have one damage. Yeah, one extra damage. But you have the issue that you move to the right. Really bad ability. Do I need to place you on the corner? Yeah, I should have read that first. Decisions. So, this is a good card to play, because if it dies I get value. You... Also give me value if I play you, because I will get an end. I can use the end to make pressure, which is good. You will attack and move to the right. You will attack and move to the right. You will block. Oh, it's only after attacking. So, you will attack, you will block, and then you will move to the right. Blocking this fellow with zero damage. Then I can strike back. What can I do, actually? If I place a card here, I will then move to this position and block the Mantis. Which is not what I want, because it will also block the Stink Book. Okay, uh, I'm thinking too much. I should just, I should just play something. Okay, uh... Actually, no. Okay, so, by the looks of it... I can draw... The card I want. Need the cat. And I can draw another one. This is broken. Okay. The music is good. Probably a little bit too loud, but uh, yeah. I do no miracles. Let me just reduce it a little bit more. Okay. Uh, mm, what should I pick? I need to leave cards for the next round. So, good choices. You will also block the other one, which is pretty damn good. I should kill this one. And deal some damage. So, I don't have any creature with that touch. You are unkillable, and you have retaliation damage, which is good versus that one. Undying. Four bones, though. I will not get many bones. I should get... what should I get? Alpha is a good card right here. You'll move alongside the stink bug, and it requires four bones. No can do. I will get one bone this turn only. I'll get you. But you must defeat him first. I have to defeat him first, I thought I had to die, okay. So, Mantis God. I need to play the cat, but I hope he doesn't strike it, because otherwise I will be damned. Actually, I should play it here, because I think you will play another card in this round, after, in this position. 
You will attack here. You will... Let's play it here. So, I will do a move. We need to play something decent. Wolf should be good here. Or the Santa's Wolf. Wolf should be good here. Alright, let's pass. Are you serious? Are you actually serious? Are you... So, he warns me of the ability he's gonna do. At the end of the turn, it does it. I thought it was whenever he died, dude. Okay, that's broken. I need squirrels. Yes, I do. I can draw another one, which I'm gonna draw here. I need to deal damage first. What does he get on the board? I didn't see that. Oh, I cannot see now. I want to get a Mantis God, I think. And it seems like I have to kill him really fast. So Alpha with the Mantis God should be a good combo. I should place uh, Alpha here. Triple kill. Or triple damage, which should be 9 damage in total. Yeah, I cannot beat him with this deck, I think. At least the way it's going. That hand is a good pick. No, it does not retaliate. Then damage. Cockroach is good. So, what is this? Amalgam. Another Mantis God. So, he got no ability right now. But I will take three in here and I will go. I will take four actually. I cannot sacrifice this. So, I'm actually dying this time. What? I need to make a blocker here. Uh, one, three, so it will kill me while I still take one from the Mantis Gun. These two spots will free. Ah, I cannot sacrifice anything, so I need to play the smoke. So that's the three is blocker. So it will steal the... Precious one, so I'll get a squirrel. I have a squirrel already, whatever. I need another one. Yeah, true. This S1 HP. But wasn't this a 1 3? Okay, that this is troublesome. I get retaliation damage in here. I kill. I can finish probably one round. No, I cannot. I can play his cards. Wolf. I'm gonna run out of cards before I actually kill him. Yeah, I have to be on the offensive. It looks like. So, Corpse Maggot should be the way here. Now I need to sacrifice this. Shove. A cockroach in there. It's a 2-2. Two, two. Damn. Miscalculation. Because it will take two and die. It will die from this one. Oh, bueno. Here it will die. I need to kill the Mantis God anyway. So, best choice is to attack here. So, worker and and now a squirrel. Okay. Right. Oh, I'm dead. Oh, I'm on HP. I forgot about that. Okay, so. Let me check out the board. I have one damage for. He has a blocker. I can deal one, two, three. So now is the good time to play the Mantis God. I'll need a squirrel. Yes, I will need a squirrel. And what else?
A squirrel, another squirrel. The squirrels, I hope they are infinite. If they're not, I am done. Okay. Mantis got in here. And something to attack here. Preferably an ant. I mean, I don't need to place the Mantis God here. I can just attack here with something. Tree attack. Which means an ant. Yeah, exactly. Good. No, three, three. Should be fine. The end strikes back. Okay. What ability is that? Oh, he's gonna make me trade pelts or something? I don't remember that, but he's dying this turn. One life only. This dives beneath and it has the symbol. So, I think it's an ability. If you get your precious by combat. Oh, only if it's on. Okay. I think he plays a lot of cards and I have to trade belts. Right? Let's see how it goes. Owns lot of rare creatures. That was not the issue. The issue was your shenanigans. Okay. Shadowy figures appear before you. Uh, their eyes glimmer the recognition of kinship, but colored by guilt. They were betraying you. What? I killed that card. Retaliation and bifurcated strike. Okay. I don't know which to draw actually now. Uh, so I should take. Probably the both hand will help me here. I have uh, three squirrels, should be fine. And here I should get a better card in there, like another end. So, 4 2, 4 2. The end strikes back. Perfect. I forgot about the overkill damage. Trade for what you can, but know this for the rest, will stay and fight for me. Wolf Cup with whatever. Elk. Whatever. I don't want to trade anything. How do I trade? What do I trade, actually? Oh, I have one pelt. It gave me one pelt. Should I get Casey? Wait, what? He, he has one HP only. Why? How did he kill the end? Minsky, what? So I need ants. If you get a strike and retaliation damage, that touch would have been better. Uh, I have enough squirrels. I need to let you just draw another squirrel to be sure. It will block anything with one retaliation damage. Wait, the squirrels run out. Okay, uh, I need to play this in a different way then. But uh, worker ant. Ah, I should have more cats. So it takes eight, so it means he's out. <clears throat> What's the shenanigans now? This damned moon, it's dramatic, yes. But it provides no value to my birth, I wonder. Wait, what? Oi, 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 oi. Nani, Soria. Uh, what's that? 
the moon 40 hp uh, it has everything attacks on every direction one damage on everything so if i have that touch this is gg gg right and this still has does that touch work should work right no you're not going you're you kind of useless uh let's just take a precaution and bring the oh actually i need to anyway alpha i can sacrifice it if i need oh i need that touch i've been saving that touch for some really strong creature which seems the time has come good luck damn that's a lot of coins uh okay now you take six where's the six damage oh you actually take more than six yeah i meant this got is really broken wait what enduring victory What? You got slept? Hey. Flashlight. Oh, I mean, flash bang. Uh, hello? Okay, so this is the interesting one. I mean, it should be. How do I go back? Okay. Oh, shit, yeah, nice reaction. <laughs> hey there, card gamers. I'm the Lucky Carter, and this is another pack opening video. Today, I am opening Catch Monster Pack. And oh, I love opening those packs. They smell so good. Dog! And here I'll add some crazy VFX to like the opening of them. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, I am about to open my first pack. Feeling good about <laughs> Do them. not open them like that. What are you doing? Real good. Ooh, I guess that's the way to open that. But I've never opened them like that. Okay. And our first rare is a Bertrand. Not exactly a viable competitive card, but hey, it's a pretty one. All right. Earth openings. Next pack. Feeling even better about this one. I gotta say, these cards are feeling extra silky today. I mean, yeah, I'm gonna keep my way of opening them. They're so smooth. Not sure what they're doing. They now. smell good. Also, uh, smell them. Factory, smell them. They smell so good. good At least magic, the one, magic entering the okay. ones. They smell so good. Let's see what we got here. Some dank cards. Maybe a few additions to my draft cube. We'll see. And our rare for this pack is Bamdog. Not exactly riveting so far, but we have many packs to go. Next pack, here we come. Just cut out the sparkles. What kind of boosters are those actually? Cannot. Uh I don't know. Our rare for hey there, card gamers. I'm the Lucky Carter, and this is a Oh, where is the normal play? Hey there, card gamers. I'm the Lucky Carter, and this is a vintage pack opening video. Today I'm opening a vintage pack. Rare old packs I snag at a garage sale. I've got four packs. Just get a Black Lotus, GG. <laughs> Now, not all of you will even remember this game. Oh, what game? Uh, wrong button again. I'm barely old enough to have uh, seen these going around in my childhood. Uh, for whatever reason, they only did one set of these cards and then stopped printing. Oh, one set? What is it? Uh, there's not a huge market for them anymore, but at the rate of the card goes for a couple hundred bucks. So, interesting. Show me the backs of them. 
It don't look bad actually. Oh, it's inscription. Oh, it's not an inscription, is it? I cannot read it. And our rare for this pack is Blue Mage. Cool looking card, but not going to be worth very much. All right. Let's see what we got going on in the second pack. <laughs> and hope and open. And three seals. Hope no one snuck the rare out of it. Game pick. Come on, people, honestly. Who opens and reseals a pack? Ah. There's a set of coordinates on this card. What? Looks like they were drawn on with a pen. It's the cabin. 49 degrees north, 123 degrees. Check, but I think that's pretty nearby. Oops, sorry. Okay. Alright, you guys. And I'm that's how you get kidnapped. Living <laughs> my best life. Got my trusty headlamp and shovel. Always come prepared, kids. There we go. Yeah. Okay. Whew. Getting close. I think. Assuming there is a thing to get close to. This very well may be a massive waste of. Oh, that's cool. Okay, so the next one is the freaky one. All right. That's why you always bring an extra battery, boys and girls. Oh, run out of battery. Every time. You gotta come prepared. <sighs> See? Alright, this is it. And now, we dig. Ooh, ooh, there's something. I give a 75% chance it's a rock. But <laughs> no, it, it doesn't sound like it. Sounds like something empty. I mean, something with something empty inside, like a chest or something. What the fuck? Yeah. What is that? Oh my god, you guys, I can't believe it. There's actually something Or a here. coffin. Oh my god! I don't know how they're called in English, what? but I used to use them actually. Uh, a flop disk? Is that a flop disk? I don't know the English name actually. Because yes. yeah, by that time, are you seeing this? <laughs> there was internet. There were no more of these. I'm uh, I'm a little confused. Inscription. That's pretty cool. Uh, so. Oh yeah, I drive to actually run that. Okay, time to figure out what's on this thing. Oh, he was the one that started the game. 
That's why we only have the continue. No, he doesn't have the, the start as well. That would be funny. It would have been pretty funny, actually. So how do I... Yeah. I do not celebrate often, and I seldom give gifts. But you challenger, you are worthy. Okay, thank you. Please not... Ah, uh, do not be polite. Dig in. What? Doesn't look tasty at all. Yeah, it doesn't look tasty. Also, I don't want to turn off candles because they symbol uh, they symbolize life in here. And I could be killing myself. I need to go with you. But there is a camera here. Take the picture. You failed miserably. Wait, you, you didn't fail? Is this... This her is card? Oi, I need lighting. I cannot go forward. Hello, I cannot see anything. I cannot go forward. Hello? Jump scare incoming? Or I don't know what's happening because I cannot go forward. Hello? Hey! Hello! Am I supposed to quit? And start a new game? Oh, that's probably the case, right? But now I've became the man in the cabin. Because I'm stuck. Right. Okay, let's go to the third screen. And I should have the other. Exactly. But. Should I? I mean, I have to. Can I use the continue? Let's see what happens. So I am still stuck in here, so... Oh, there is that I can see is a candle. So that means I have to go to search screen and press the new game. Unexpected data encountered. Wiping expected, unexpected data, creating new, forging deck data. No, my deck! In the beginning, the world did not know cards. Oh, that's pretty cool. Uh, uh, that is, until the day the scribes arrived. Oh! So that's the wolf? That's the... Each add their own methods of inscription to create cards. Alright. Grimora used the Urquil to inscribe her, the epitaphs of the dead. But I missed one of them, right? Leshy used this wildlife camera. So Leshy was the fella that was playing against me. This was the stunt. The skank? Stout, the stunt. This was the stunted wolf. 
with the cards created, the scribes had solidified their power. Oh, it's so fast forward, okay. The one that can challenge the right to replace one of the scribes. So. That's me, right? I can move? Uh, I cannot move? I can move. Use a starting deck to mark your ambition. So, can I see the decks? Uh, I cannot see the decks. So, but this is the stout. This... Okay, this looks like... The Santa's Wolf. Fleshy was the fellow that was against me. And this looks like the... What was she called? I don't know. Uh, it was an insect type. This guy has magic though. I mean, it looks like a wizard head. I'm gonna go for the wizard head because I like wizard heads. But this is like a hand of the dead or something. This looks like beasts. This looks like robots. A robotic eye. Magic is good, right? Magic. Magnificus and become the scrapdom of the magics. But he's a nice fella. Eo3 and become the scrap of technology. Oh, I got them right, right? Scrap of the beasts. Or. Remora that become the scrap of the dead. This looks like a broken mechanic because I really like cards that go to graveyards and back and stuff like that so like recycling making multiple use of the same cards the game changed completely what the hell I did not see this coming, actually. Okay, let me see the other options. Damn. Rest in pepperonis, okay. Oh, it's her. I am Grimora, a scribe of the dead, yeah. Until quite recently, I was disgraced. Was returned from a friend recorded with the hope of some unlikely friends, but if you were to your skills against me, you must first prepare- Oh, yeah, no. Each stone marks the final resting place of my beloved- Our lovely ghouls. Okay, that's a quest for another day, Yes. Right now- Oh, so, the four of them. So, this is Lashy. This is the- I don't remember, but the insect- Oh. Magic. Robots. So four challenges, I would assume. Then there are like some off-road. Alright, fellas. That's it for today. Oh, now I can alter my deck. I, I, I always could, right? Or I could not. Oh, the decks are... The cards are different. I have to take a look at this. Do I only have these cards? I'll have to check them actually to see if they're good. Uh, so, back at it. Thanks for watching, fellas. See you next time. Peace. Oh, it changed as well. <laughs>